All right, folks, welcome back to the Daily Channel. Today we are going thrifting, getting things started off at this Goodwill. We've had some pretty good luck here in the past, but never know what you're gonna find though, so. Let's go find it. Let's go find it. Also, Happy New Year. Yes. It is uh, January 1st, it's so a it's a new, new year. year. New thrift store. Uh, old thrift store. Old thrift store. Well, this is actually the newest thrift store yeah, in the area. So yeah, you were right. You didn't even know it. You're always right. <laughs> Never question your wife. That's the uh, number one rule if you get anything out of this video, which you probably won't, but uh, that's the number one rule. Your yes. wife is always right. But let's see what this Goodwill has got for us today. All right, it is super busy here today. We found one quiet little corner. We went through one rack of the shoes. There's like 10 of them. So we've already found some uh, good stuff. Let's start off with these. We got some Kyrie uh, Irving SpongeBob shoes. These are not in the uh, best condition yeah, whatsoever. I saw one go for $99 pre-owned, but definitely not in that Condition. Yeah, definitely not in that condition, but uh, still cool yeah, to uh, find. Fine. And speaking of a uh, cool to find, I've never found a pair of these. These are, I think they're called Diodoras or something like that. They're popular in uh, Europe and they're kind of high end. These uh, go for like $60, got a little bit of wear on them, mm -hmm. but I tried these on, they're my size. They are ridiculously comfortable. They're like, I don't even know like how to compare them. Yeah, definitely gonna really pick them up. Nice for, yeah, I'm gonna pick them up for myself. $12.99, they should wash that pretty good, but oh, yeah. they are, I pretty sure I could walk around every single uh, Disney park in the same day in those nice. ones. And then we also got some uh, Nike Vapor Max. These things are like $180 brand new, not in the best condition, but they still should sell for like 60 or uh, $70. And to top that off, we got Minor the, League Baseball. Yeah, the Traverse City Spitters. Oh man, I just had it. Is that they're, what they're called? They're like, hold on, let me see. I they're out of Michigan, again. I think, right? I don't remember now. Yeah, no, Traverse City Spitters. They are the pit spitters. Oh, the pit spitters. There you go. I love minor league baseball. Minor league names. baseball teams have the uh, the best names. But oh yeah. Definitely off to a uh, good start. It is pretty busy. busy. No one's in the pillow section. <laughs> also, it helps with the audio. It's not as echoey. There you go. There you Muffled. go. Muffled. <laughs> Sweet. I think. Well, I don't know. Got ton. There's a like quesadilla maker. Almost look like pierogies. That's why I got excited. <laughs> right. Pierogi quesadilla maker. Yeah, that pierogi, uh, like the presser. Yeah, yeah, we got that at this Goodwill. Sweet. Maybe we'll find other things to make pierogies. There you go. Like potatoes and pasta at Goodwill. <laughs> I don't think so. There's a public next door. Yeah. All right. Pretty good start. Keeping on the hat theme right here, we got a John Deere golf visor. This thing is uh, pretty cool. Only $2.99. One of the uh, more underrated tournaments. Had a bunch of uh, crazy finishes. That's mm. where uh, Jordan Spieth won his uh, first tournament, yeah. holding out from the uh, bunker. Also, there, it might be a clip on the uh, internet, but uh, I remember Zach Johnson was uh, taking a uh, putt there and a boat went by and it sounded like a bomb went off. And then like all of a sudden you see like the uh, police boats going uh, after him. Also, yeah. I'm pretty sure that uh, Steve Strucker has like won half of his career earnings at this uh, one tournament. Really? That's a really long uh, story about a uh, visor. <laughs> but uh, another long story, apparently too long of a story for uh, waiting for the uh, Mets to, uh, or the uh, Knicks to win a uh, championship. This New York fan got rid of basically their entire collection. This one's brand new with tags. I didn't even yeah, notice that. They were we, just done. Yeah, we got an Amon Shumpert uh, t-shirt jersey right here and a bunch of uh, Met ones. Yeah. We got a Met one, Mets ones, that's hard to say. Yeah. Jason Bay going on right there and francisco rodriguez my brother love these he's a i'm a mets fan but he's like a die hard mets uh, fan oh we got pyrex yeah that's uh, pretty cool is that pyrex or it kind of looks like pyrex no it's made by pyrex oh made by pyrex and then we got a johan santana cy young award winning uh, oh and then there's all of our stuff that we already had oh what, i forgot about this one oh oh no i didn't even go through half of it what am i doing <laughs> chaos just like uh, usual we could show that shirt you don't have to throw it down there Oh, this sorry. one, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was just like, well, that's a really weird shirt. Yeah. It's Nike, but it's the Olympics one. That is super cool. That's why. U.S. Oh, pride yeah. right there. Got that the one. Going. Yeah, we should have worn that during the uh, World Cup or something right. like that. Well, that's the Olympic I'll team. Be, yeah, it's very I'll, patriotic. I'll be ready for the future. Like, I have no idea what's going on in the scene. <laughs> I apologize. But we got a uh, old school, I think, I don't know if this is a vintage, but old school looking Tom and Jerry sweatshirt. Mm -hmm. And then we also got some conflicting views over here. Yeah. Yes, we've got a uh, Manchester United jersey and a Man City one. Those are both pretty cool, but this one is super awesome. A uh, Portland Timbers. Size nine youth. Nine youth. It's cutie. That is uh, pretty sweet. How much are the jerseys going for here? The youth ones? Uh, $7.99. How much are the uh, adult, adult ones? ones? Oh, hey, look, it's, it's an extra deal. dollar more. That's not bad at all. Pride in battle. There you go. Let us know if you're uh, Manchester United or, well, actually don't. Don't, don't let us know which one uh, you are. But uh, yeah, that could cause a brawl. <laughs> yeah, I've learned uh, having uh, the uh, Stag Golf Channel not to uh, mention which soccer team that you like because people are very passionate about it. Yes. So yeah, just ignore those. <laughs> In most of the scene. Yeah, most most of whatever I say. Just ignore everything that I say. Pirates. We're off. I found Pyrex. That's the uh, moral of the story. Yes. This is kind of fun. We should just like film us, us rolling around. Let's see what we can find. Get a bunch of jean shorts. Woo. 
a little polo. A little polo. Updates to comment what else we find. This is fantastic. We got that Orange County Choppers little bobblehead thing. We got Paul Cedar and Paul Jr. and Mikey take it out the trash. Uh, he's like the first person to have dad shoes and wear them uh, ironically. Pretty sweet. Comment below if you ever watched that uh, show. It was actually pretty good. Yeah. I had no interest in uh, motorcycles. But, At all. Yeah. Also, why do they have bobbleheads? We'll never know. Even they don't know. Look at them. They don't know. See, he doesn't know. All right, life lessons with Ashley. She's laughing at me because I have no idea what this is. This is my fascination is figuring out. Is it a portable washing machine? Close. Close? I'm Can you dry your lettuce in there? I'm sure it's for like mopping. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's pretty sophisticated. Yeah, so you can take it around and oh, clean Oh, and then that mop. dries it off and then you, yeah, you wet it there and then that's the soap. Pretty mm. sure. Could be a... Uh, let us know if we're both wrong. Let us know if that is a lettuce washer. Probably not a lettuce Probably not, not a... Not very sanitary. Not very uh, sanitary, <laughs> but uh, updates to come. We got some top shelf material right here. We got a two gigabyte MP3 player. I remember when that was like absolutely oh. gigantic. I remember, what was the biggest one that you, like when you were a kid? I was really excited about 64. Yeah, was I was thinking like, 128. <laughs> yeah. Also, there's like a lifetime supply of uh, ink and toner over there. Huh. And if you spill that, you're going to need this, a spot lifter, brand new in the packaging, a Bissell spot lifter. I think this is going for, oh, it's got a um, price right there for 22, but what is Goodwill getting for it? Where'd it go? It's oh. oh, it's a uh, proud partner of uh, Ronald McDonald. Top? Top. Of course, I choose the uh, hardest place go. to get thirty dollars, <laughs> but this thing is uh, selling for over uh, sixty. Yeah, seventy dollars. Yeah, so at least over fifty. Yeah, that is uh, pretty cool. Awesome. Almost as cool. Found myself a little the world's smallest chair. It's a, a pocket, pocket chair. chair. It apparently holds two hundred fifty pounds. It even holds me. We'll put that to the limit. Looks more appropriate to your size, though. Oh, look, it's the world's smallest <laughs> put it chair. To, put it to the test. <laughs> you, I, I hardly doubt you weigh two hundred and fifty pounds. <laughs> But I'm totally getting this. This yeah. is going to be like me waiting in every single line now. Yeah, I'm you waiting for me to make my putts. <laughs> the world's greatest putter is the one putter every single time. Butts, not oh, butts. yeah. Gotta make like, my butts. <laughs> make my grilled cheeses out of butt bread. The best. Those are. This no, video is going off the rails. Buns. Yeah, hamburger, hamburger buns, buns, grilled cheese. cheese. Yeah, and you press it really good and you have a ton of cheese in there. It's the way to go. That is the way to go. Along with the pocket chair. All right, we're gonna have to dwindle this down. I don't think we need everything, but lots of good stuff. More to come, too. Well, Ashley's dream car. Oh. No matter what it is, as I always say it's Ashley's dream car. And then last time it was a uh, a G wagon. They're like, man, Ashley's got really good at like high end taste of cars. No, I think you'd just be hysterical if I popped out of a G wagon. Yeah, would be like really your, confused. Yeah, your dream car is like a thirty year old Volvo, oh, the old boxy it. ones so with the weird like headrest with their they're like yeah yeah yeah, all of, yeah amazing. No, yeah. they're perfect. All right, now you know actually. Well, oh, isn't that what we got? This is yeah, what we got our. Yeah, my we nephew. got our nephew this for our Christmas and Your my brother, brother is still building it. Yeah. It's a work in progress. We were FaceTiming with him and it took it like we were on there for probably an hour and he didn't finish that building it. I think he started wrong and it was all downhill from there, just like this video. But our nephew is down love. Yeah, he's big into, big into pirates. <laughs> Whoa, check this out. They literally just brought out a cart and there's a whole set of Callaway X22 irons in here. This is insane. They're only $19.99. Literally just a fresh cart brought out. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pitching wedge all the way down to the sand wedge. That is insane. What flex are these? Women's flex. Oh, yeah. These are really easy to hit. Yeah, those are unbelievably easy to hit. You mm -hmm. play the uh, Apex ones right now. Yeah. Oh, man. That was a crazy score. <laughs> yeah, that literally just straight hitting off. Of, yeah, hitting right <laughs> off the uh, cart. That was sick. <laughs> yeah, what a find. Still can't believe that they literally just put them out on the cart. We got ourselves some goodies, some treasures. Oh, yeah. That was... I was wondering why you just darted off. Yeah, <laughs> you were like uh, standing there by the cart and I was like, what? <laughs> and then, uh, man, straight from uh, Goodwill's cart into our cart. But these things go for over $300. The only like uh, listing that's kind of comparable to these, there's a few that went for like two or three hundred dollars, but they're like seven iron through a uh, pitching wedge. But this is four iron all the way down to sandwich, and there was a uh, five iron down to the pitching wedge yeah. that sold for like three fifty. So literally, they just like had three hundred fifty dollars at the minimum just yeah. sitting in their uh, cart for twenty bucks. For twenty bucks, all with the original grip in perfect condition. Yeah. But that was unbelievably. That was a nice spot. Yeah. The uh, newest uh, Goodwill in town had the uh, newest golf clubs that we found all year. Yeah. Because it's, uh, ah, it's the new year. Yeah. I see what you did but, uh, there. But while we have a, a quick second, check this out. I'm going to flip you around. Well, I'm going to oh, set these down. Here, oh, oh, hold it. I oh, got it. Ashley's, Ashley found everything today. <laughs> there you go. Thumbnail. What? Get out of it because the thumbnails do bad when I'm in it. Stop. But uh, check this out. For being a new thrift store, it has like the, there's no fitting room in there. No. 
but they did manage to carve out an entire hole through the strip mall for donations. Let me know what you think is more valuable, having people go around the building and uh, drop stuff off or go through or having a, a fitting room at a uh, thrift store. It's kind of weird. Very strange. Very strange, just like most of our videos. But <laughs> hope you guys did like this video, daily vlog number something. I can't wave. Oh no, <laughs> you've outsmarted me once again. You. You're always right, that's what we said in the uh, intro. <laughs> What a uh, perfect uh, day. Hope you guys did like this video. Hopefully your new year has gotten off to a uh, good start. Yeah. Ours got off to a late start because we were up uh, watching the uh, football. It was pretty intense that last was night. so intense. Yeah, that was a lot of uh, fun. But I uh, hope you guys did like this video. If you don't like it, to subscribe. And we'll see you next time. I'm going to try and get it. Oh, wave. yeah. We got to do the, uh, funk, the funky chicken <laughs> to go with our pit spitters uh, baseball hat. That was so cool. Yeah, also, I think that's a road trip. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to catch you off. What oh, you yeah. saying? Oh, just cool stuff. There. Oh, yeah. But we uh, got the uh, road trek over there. That's been one of our dreams to uh, hop in a van. Well, you can't really hop in them. They're super expensive now. Yes, But uh, to uh, get a van and just like go thrifting and play a bunch of golf courses. One day. One day. Let us know if you think that would be uh, interesting. And uh, don't let us know your opinion of this video or your soccer teams because <laughs> it's probably not very good. But hope you guys did like this team. Well, did like this team. Well, wow, now I'm confused. We're on, a, we're our own team. Yeah, John we're our own Ash. team. Hopefully you guys. Are you team John and Ash? <laughs> Everybody's Hopefully. team Ashley. Hopefully this was a great video. Oh, there you go. Was... Hope you guys like this video. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you next oh, time. Thumbnail, thumbnail, thumbnail. Uh... Yeah, there you go. Oh, gosh, Golf clubs are waving for me. There you go. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye.